Good afternoon. The afternoon is almost done now. Okay. In this video, we're gonna talk about update methods. Okay. Here, I only introduce update one, update many, and the replace one. And actually, there are other additional methods which in the available for you to update to do the update, like uh, find one and update, and find one replace. Okay. You can take a look at others by yourself. Okay. So. Update one, uh, which is uh, how to use that update one, which is only update the first argument it find based on your query. Okay, update many gonna update everything. Okay, uh, eh, oh, no, update all the documents and replace one is only to uh, is replace everything you put in this method with uh, for the first document it find. Is it make that make sense? Okay. Uh, anyway, we will have an example now. Okay. So here, uh, this is our inventory, and I insert lots of uh, documents. Uh, here. Okay. So now, uh, let's take a look at which has uh, more. If I uh if I if I using a filter based on the status, okay, a we have one, two, three, four, five, six. We have uh, four document which have a status and which is a right. And uh, suppose I write a query like this one: db dot inventory dot update one. The the first argument is a query, okay, query. Query, 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 query is a status, and the value is a. Okay, and then after this update, you will tell what you gonna change. Okay, what you gonna change? I will change the quantity to be uh to be ninety nine. Here I don't have any ninety nine. Okay, I will change to be ninety nine. Then you will need to set and the what you wanna change quantity to be ninety nine. Since we are using update one, it will only update one document. Even though here I have uh, lots of them, it only update one. And uh, which one? The first one it find it gonna re, uh, update that one. So based on this idea, this is gonna be fine. Uh, the first one gonna be fine. So here it's gonna change to be ninety nine. Let's take a look at it. okay. Okay, then fine. You will see the first one canvas. Canvas is changed to be 99. Got it? And uh, you can also set for as many as values you want, like I said, to be 99. I change the, uh, what others? Okay. Mm. I change the size, uh, size, size dot h. Okay. I change size dot h, this uh, height to be another, which is uh, uh, 55. Okay, and if you want to change others, you can change. Okay, and then let's see. This is size it change to be uh, fifty five now. Okay, suppose you want to update all the documents. If their status is a P, I change the quantity to be one hundred. Okay. If you want to change for these two documents, right? Then don't using update one. Using the uh, db dot uh, inventory dot update many okay and you give a filter filter is status and the value is p p capital p and then you set what kind of part you want to change okay using set okay set and uh, we do uh, quantity right quantity to be uh, 100 right so here this two value gonna change to be 100 let's change to be 19 like this okay and eh? oh, 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 oh did you see here I forgot uh, I forgot here has a brace and then here has the one brace more okay so here like this okay like this and we're using find 
and you will see these two change to be a eight 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 eight. And uh, without a set, let's take a look at if I don't have this set, what's gonna happen? Okay, if I directly using quantity to be seven 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 seven. seven okay, you are gonna have an error. Must have atomic operator. You have to have a set. If you want, to, this one means the idea is you want to replace all the documents here. Okay, replace with this one. And to do that, you have to using replace one. You cannot replace all. There's one called replace one. Okay, let's see what's gonna happen. Then you will see this document. You want to see item. You want to see size, you will only see a quantity is 7777. And then let's find. Take a look at this one. This document. It replaced everything with whatever in the second document. Let me show you this one, okay? Let's do one more time. DB dot inventory dot uh, uh, replace one, okay? The first uh, for update one, update many, replace one. The first uh, argument here, parameter here in this method is always uh, to do the is a condition. How to find the document and uh, to do the update. And this here I using item. Item is a canvas. Okay, and then whatever you put it here. Like uh, here, I, I have a post ID equals one and uh, now uh, body body is uh, update methods to uh, video. Okay, so whatever you put on the second video, gonna replace everything in your first document. Okay, gonna replace everything in your first document except the ID. Except this ID, all other part in your first document gonna be replaced by this one. Okay, let me sh let's see. And find you will see the see the first one, the first one, the ID, the ID here, two eight one right. See here two eight one previous item canvas quantity. Now it replace as what you put in the second uh, uh, parameter. Okay. And uh, just uh, choose the way you want. If you want to use an update one, just use an update one. If you want to use an update many, just use an update many, okay? And uh, there are other options available in their official document, like a find and a modify one, find and a replace one, okay? Uh, learn by yourself, okay? Uh, thank you for watching this video. Bye-bye.